If you go outside in the street and if you see two kids playing, the game that they will playing it's that killing. This one kill this one, or this boy take this girl and go outside like kidnap her, acting and playing. But this thing inside their mind, so this thing is is just growing and growing in their mind. And this thing it's mean like there is more generation and more kids rising with this demon and this evil thinking. So this thing is have to stop. It's have to stop by the love of God, like to show them the love of God, to show them that is, there is God, real God, and real love, real grace, real thing that is happening. There is someone love you till the die, till the cross. It's Jesus Christ, because the the message that the kids take it since they are kids, the rejection. The feeling of rejection, the feeling of afraid, the feeling of um, uh, no one love me, the feeling of um, the the how how to I should live through killing, through make people afraid from me. The same drama like with their parents and the generation is going and rising up in this way. So this thing is very dangerous. Not only for the the country, not only for the people like. Like we have to stop it, we have to stop it by the grace of God, by the love, by the that we, we share the message that God love you, Jesus, Jesus Christ is here. We are coming alongside families just like this all over northern Iraq to assist with the daily needs of nutritious food, of school supplies and school uniforms, of consistently showing and sharing them that they are loved by the King of Kings, that they are valuable and that they do not need to live in fear because there is hope in Christ. Would you join me in replacing fear with hope in the life of a refugee child today? You can sponsor online at www.indigenousministries.org or by calling our home office 719-302-3028. I can't wait to introduce you to one or two of these precious kids. I want to thank you for listening to this video and connecting with me personally on this crisis. And this is what we're praying for for the Middle East, is that the Lord who is the Lord of the Middle East would heal through our partnership together to minister to children the hope and the grace of Jesus Christ. May God bless you in every way and his richest blessing.